feels good. Really? Before you feel better. <laughs> you know, looking at you right now, I want to go over and over again. Really? <laughs> Alex isn't in the one. No, no, I'm not. Um, just give me a minute. Maybe it's my, my neighbors, okay? Come on, okay. My neighbors. I'm sorry, I'll be back. I'm just. Okay, you can play the door, okay? Okay? Okay. Alright, okay. Please be fast. Alright, I'll be fast. Too good. Um, no, no, I'm not feeling too good. I have pain all over my body. Uh -uh. Pain. I'm sorry, baby. Have you taken something for it? Yeah, I took some medications. I intend to see the doctor much later in the evening. Have okay. You? What's that? Food. Ooh. Yeah. Me and Susan are going to the salon, so I decided to make something for you because, well, you know I don't like my baby to stay hungry. Yeah. Wow. My mm -hmm. favorite. Mm -hmm. Jello fries, fish, and moi moi. That's a thoughtful of you. <laughs> What can I do without you? Absolutely nothing, baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm just gonna go um, check. Babe, what? Um, you know, like I said, I I really need to rest. I well, I'm having body pain, so I'm, I'm sure after I rest, I eat the food, I will feel better, and go out. Okay, but baby, is that why you're sweating so much? Gosh. Yeah, I I, I think it's a sickness that's trying to come out, you know, and yeah. Okay, well, in that case. I should go meet up with Susan. Oh. Yeah, so I don't keep her waiting. Okay. Call me if you need anything. I'm sure. Mm. Are you sure that you're okay though? I'm, I'm sure after resting and eating your food, I'm sure be fine. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. All, All right. right. I'm going. All right. I love you, baby. I love you too. Work it. <laughs> Work it, baby. Bye. All right, love. Bye. <laughs> Baby, 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 guess who's back? <laughs> baby, what is it? Nothing. Nothing, but, but we're not done yet, right? Still, I'm done with you if I can't move. You what? I'm leaving. Big cool. What is it? About Vera, right? Come on, babe. I've begged and pleaded for time. Time to break things off with Vera. Steve, you've continually said that. Honestly, it's no longer funny. I don't know if you're waiting for the whole of eternity for you to know what to do. We've been dating for the past four years. You, you've not even introduced me to any of your family member or even your friends. You know what? Sometimes I begin to wonder if you really have a family or. If you're a ghost or something. No, you should let me know because I need to know. Baby, baby, come on. Come on, just relax, okay? You know what? I'll take you to meet my family. Come on, now. I love you. Steve, if you love me, then you do the right thing. Okay, I... I'll do the right thing. I promise. Okay, I, I promise. Come on. Come on, smile for me. Okay? Alright? Come on, other smile, the other one. Yeah, this one, yeah, this one. 
this smile. <laughs> but in the meantime, come on, get some sugar, babe. Um, you didn't tell me you were coming. Um, um I, hi, um, good to see you here, though. Yeah. Um, my, um, this is, um, um, Oluchi. Oluchi is my, my cousin. Um, she, I mean, it's been a while we saw, Wait, so, I mean, kind did of. did you just say cousin? Yeah, my, my cousin, yeah. There's wow. a resemblance, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah, no, I'm just excited. Yeah, but I mean, because, I mean, it's been a long time we saw, and I'm just glad to know that she actually came here to see me today for like a long time. Oh. You know, um, um. You know, when we were little, um, our dad was moved to Abuja. Okay. So, I mean, we've lost contact, like, since forever. And, you know, she just pays me a visit. Um, Oluchi, this is um, Vera. V v Vera is my, my, my girlfriend. Yeah. Hi. Okay, sorry. This, this seems a little awkward. I don't know. But, look, I'm really excited to meet you. Actually, I've known your cousin. Yeah, I've known this guy for six years. Six years. <laughs> and trust me, this is the very first time I'm meeting any of his relatives. So I am really, really excited to meet you. <laughs> yeah, um, I, I, and I'm sure she's also happy to, to see you, right? Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. She, 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 she needs to go now. She's actually on her way out before okay. you, you came through. Um, okay, sorry, excuse me. Um, I'll, I'll you, so once you get home, go tell Uncle cool that um, I'll, I'll get back to him on that, okay? I'll see how it goes and... Um, I mean, in fact, I'll call him. Okay, I'll, I'll call him today. Okay, okay. And please, don't, don't look for trouble, oh, Oluchi. Don't look for trouble. Don't don't ask cab guy for for change. Just go home straight. <laughs> She's just troublesome. Hey, baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay, seriously though, but is your cousin? She does. I don't know. She didn't seem too happy to see me. Though. No, no, that's not the issue. I mean, the thing is. My uncle, our dad, is not mm. feeling too good, so she actually came here to try and get some phones mm. of me, you know, and hey, maybe she's in a period. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I know how cranky you can be yeah, in a period. A, uh, shut up, you're, <laughs> you're not serious. Well, why were you actually so surprised to see me? Nobody you sent me a text message that we're oh, going out. Man, I'm, wrong with oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Come let's go. Let's go. Right, okay. <laughs> Steve. Yeah, good afternoon. Steve, I'm good, and you? Okay. Sorry? She's not in my house. I've not seen her for a while now. No, she's not here. I've been trying her number and it's not going through. Steve, what happened? What have you done to my friend? Steve, what have you done to my friend? Okay, I'll see you shortly. No problem. Exactly what I told you. 
okay, listen, I've complained to you severally about very uh, and, and, and her temper. She's so quick to react. You know, she actually blocked all form of communication with me because she saw a girl in my house, my cousin, my very cousin. Can you imagine that? Okay, did you try communicating with her, maybe speaking with any member of her family or something? Yeah, I, I've done all that, but no one seems to know where about. I can't even reach her myself because the last time she came to my house and saw my cousin, she angrily dropped her phone and ran away. Steve, just calm down. Calm down. This hasn't come to that. Uh, don't you think we should involve the police? Police? No, no, no. Come on. For, for, for what exactly? But let's make this fact clear. Vera is a grown woman. Okay, wherever she is, I'm sure she's fine. I don't know. I just... I just have this feeling something is wrong with her. No, no, no. I, th I think she's fine. Okay, I just think that maybe she, she doesn't want to see me anymore. And hey, if this is the way she wants to break up this relationship, then it's fine. Okay, I'm not going to go about... Sorry, excuse me. Hey, hi. Yeah, I'm, I'm great. How, how you doing? Eh? Oh, come on. I said that I will sort you out when I see you, okay? Yeah, I'll... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll, 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 uh, yeah. I'll, I'll see you soon, okay? Kiss, right. kiss. <laughs> What do you want? I came here so we can talk. There is nothing to talk about. Okay? Please leave. I will. But please hear me out. I'm sorry for hiding my past life from you. Alvin, I love you so much. And that was the reason I refused to tell you things that could make you run away from me. All I did was motivated by survivor instinct. And I was totally in the position of no choice. And... Look! There's no need for all this explanation, okay? I thought we've gone through this before. I have made my decision. I will not marry a prostitute. Ex-prostitute. Whatever you heard about me is in the past. Every saint has a past. Every human being has a secret he or she has chosen to die with. Including you. <laughs> Mr. Walkaholic. Ah, ah, don't go use work in yourself, oh. Eh? Uh, my brother, man, what can a man do? Um, I have too much on my table right now. I can't even think straight. Take it easy, my friend. Take it easy. I know a friend that died the other day because of stress. That is why I've taken it as a point of duty to enjoy myself anytime I see the opportunity to do that. <laughs> <laughs> and just fun. have fun. <laughs> yeah. Um, 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 talking about fun. Yeah. Today is Friday and I'm hitting the club. So, are you coming? Um, that's not a bad idea, but no, I'll pass. You try and be saying you will pass again. Waiting. Why? Why you they always dull me? You don't. You just just they always dull person these days. Why? You don't drink anymore, you don't smoke anymore, you don't do all those things that makes life thick. You don't do them anymore. Guy, you get what you want to tell me. You want to know, right? I called it up with Stephanie. You did? Yeah. 
I thought you said you guys were doing good. Yes, I said so, but not anymore. Look, right now, I cannot cope with that lady's overbearing attitude. And then her dented past is not making things any easier for me. My guy, I warned you. I warned you. I warned you from the beginning, but you didn't listen. Girls like Steph, they are meant to be used and don't. That's all. They don't have any other thing to contribute. At all. They don't. Nice. <laughs> What about your accident victim? Oh, um, she's responding well to treatment, according to the doctor. You know, but my only worry now is that I have not been able to reach either her family, friends, or relatives. You know, I can't reach anybody right now. Mm. And worse still, she hasn't said anything to anyone. This is very serious. Yeah, it is. Fine. Mm. Okay. Okay. Hello, Dr. Fine. How are you doing? I'm fine too, sir. All right. What? Okay. Um, well, she can stay in my place until we are able to locate any of her family members. Okay, she'll be discharged in a few days' time. That's good. Okay. All right. I would um, stop by the hospital from work. All right, do have a nice day, sir. All right, and you too. God bless you. Thank you. Okay. Brother, well, as the doctor. Well, he said she'll be discharged in a few days' time. Okay. But I fear there's a problem. What's that? She's developed amnesia. Oh no! Hi. Calm down. Just feel at home. This is my house. I'm, I'm sorry. Who are you again? You asked me this same question while we were in the doctor's office. Please sit down. Okay. You ran into my car. Yes, you were involved in an accident. Mm -hmm. You passed out and then I rushed you to the hospital. Um, you don't have to try and remember, okay? The doctor assured me you'll be fine in no time. Grace? Grace? Yeah. Oh, brother, you're back. Sorry, I didn't notice. How would you notice when all you do all day is cover your ears with earplugs and listen to music? Sorry. This is peace. Peace meet my kid sister Grace. You know her? Oh. Uh, no, but I, I don't think we've met before. Hi. Uh, good afternoon. You're welcome. She she looks to come. Is she all right? She's fine. Um, although the doctor said she developed amnesia due to the impact of the accident. Amnesia? Yes. That's a loss of memory. Mm -hmm. That means she cannot remember anything. Well, apparently, although the doctor said she'll be fine in no time. Oh, I'm so sorry, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Um, Grace, no one must know she's here, please. 
I suspect some people were after her that night. Yeah, I, I think so too. Show her to the room and then please bring me a glass of water, please. Okay. Hello. Okay. Madam, she forgot her airblocks. Thank God. So now that she's out of the picture, what are you going to do? Look for her. Look for her? Look for her when I'm still here? Steve, what do you take me for? My girlfriend? Is that not who you are? Can you just calm down, okay? I'm here with you. Steve! For the fact that I swallow your bush does not mean I can I can I cannot get another man out there to love me. I'm not a child. If I'm just a plaything to your life, just let me know. There you go again. There you go again. Listen, look, I'm not in the mood for all of this right now. Okay? Please. You must be in the mood. You must be in the mood. I demand to know my exact place in your life. I mean, am I that bad? Do you know how many men out there that wants me to be with them and I say no because I want to be Enough! With them? Enough! You know what? You're free. Go and meet them. If you want to fuck them, go and fuck them! But this will be the very last time, I repeat, the very last time you talk to me about such a thing. Okay? I'm tired! I'm tired of your nagging! Go to punish you, Steve! Go and punish your, punish your wretched family! Try it! Just try it and I swear to God you will never use your hand again in your life! Don't you have a conscience? All I do for you is sex, sex, sex. Why well, she's good to be taken to mama? I'm leaving. And I'm leaving for good. And don't ever call me. Don't even text me. What do you think you're going to? Don't step out until I say she step out. Okay? Sit down here! I want to leave. You don't want me again in your life. I want to go. Please just let me go, please. I want to go. I'm sorry, okay? I... I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't mean to hurt you. Come in. How are you, peace? I'm fine, sir. Good. Do you know I chose to call you peace? My late mother, her name was Peace. And she was as beautiful as you are. <laughs> um, thank you. I'm sorry about her. It's okay. So, um, have you been able to remember anything? Um, no, unfortunately. The only thing that I can remember is uh, the hospital ward. Um, the doctor and his office, and then you and your sister. Okay. That's fine. Keep trying, okay? And if you do remember anything, write it down in this book. Okay. Um, thank you very much, sir. It's all right. I'll leave you now. Sir. Thank you. Once again. Alvin. That's my name. Call me Alvin. Okay. Um, Alvin. <laughs> Thanks.
You're welcome. Hello Grace, how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine, thank you. Please are you in your room? No, I'm not in the house. Is there a problem? No, no, not really. Just that I, I, I can't find peace in this house. Oh, um, peace. She's here with me. Grace, can I call you back, please? Um, I'm in the middle of something right now. Um, I'm really sorry about the interruption. No, it's okay. Um, Mr. Alvin, how did you get my number? Oh, um, I gave her a pen and a paper to write whatever she could remember. And then later on I checked on her. And I discovered that she wrote, um, a name and a number. I thought your name is Vera. Oh, that was why you called asking to speak with Vera. Exactly. Actually, her name is Vera, not mine. My name is Susan. Okay. Um, oh, well, that means she's regaining her memory. I think so. Um, Vera? Do you remember this lady? Peace? Um, sir? Do you know this lady? <laughs> I'm sorry, I... Who are you? Who, who is she? She's your friend. Her name is Susan. Okay. It's okay. It's fine. Just um, take your time. I'm sure with time you would remember everything. Just calm down. Um, Susan, quite a lovely place you have here, I will say. Oh, thank you. Actually, it's my dad's house. Yeah. But he lives abroad now. That's nice. Um, Mr. Alvin, please can you do me a favor? Okay. I want Vera to stay with me. I beg of you. I think she will heal faster if she stays with somebody she knows a whole lot. Please do this for me. Well, you have a good point there, but... Um... I am very concerned about her safety. Alvin, I will take my life on this. Trust me. I'll take very good care of her. Please. All right. Claire? Well, you have to stay with her for a while. Okay. Um, <clears throat> if, if you think that's the best thing. She oh, gave wow. that guy that money. I told you in the last episode she was going to bring that money. You said it was a lie. Now see. Um, I'm sorry. Have I seen this show before? <laughs> Are you serious? This guy is such a crazy guy. <laughs> 
<laughs> Susan. 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 <laughs> my name. <laughs> yes, I remember you. I remember you. You were a very silly girl. Oh my God, I remember. <laughs> Jesus, this is why you've been looking at me like this. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I actually remember my best friend. I mean, there's like, there's like gaps in my memory. Like, like, um, I, I must have hit my head. I, I hit my head, right? No, Mr. Alvin said you ran into his car while some people were chasing you or something. I just can't figure out. I what ran. <laughs> Susan, what is it? Nobody was after me. Nobody was after me. It was, it was, it was Steve and 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 some I don't know thing that his 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 cousin's mother. Or I don't know. His it was Steve and then. Oh, 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 okay, it's okay. Susan, I, I ran into I ran into no, a, a, a car and then. I know. I know. Steve. Steve was. Like, Susan. He no, lied no. to me. Okay. He lied to me, and I, and I, and I ran out, and can I couldn't. Calm down. Can you just calm down? Oh my God! Oh. Steve, oh my God! You piece of shit, Steve. Okay, okay, okay. Just calm down, Vera. <laughs> He lied to me, me. He lied to me, and I almost got killed because of. Come, 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 come. once again. Thank you. Please do sit down. Okay. Okay. All right. I am so glad you're fully recovered. Well, all glory to God and thank you too for being there for me. Well, I did what I was supposed to do. I was the one who knocked it down with my car, remember? Yeah, well, but some people would have just left me there. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So, um, you said you want to go back home? Yes, uh, I want to go back home so I can start getting ready, you know, to go back to work. That's if my boss hasn't even replaced me already. <laughs> Where do you work? Um, I work as a secretary in a law firm. Mm. Okay, that's good. You know, I would have preferred you stayed in your friend's house, just like she insisted. Your safety is very important now. To be honest, <laughs> nobody's actually after me. I'm fine. I hope so. <laughs> yeah. So, um, um, what have you decided about your boyfriend? Ugh, um, nothing at the moment. Um, I'm just staying away from him, that's all I know. Uh, hey, you said something about your sister? Yeah, Grace. Uh, I wonder why she's not here, because um, she doesn't hesitate to come out whenever she hears my voice. Okay. Well, no wahala. I guess I will see her when next I come around to visit. Sure, that's true. Um, something to drink? No, I, I would really love to stay, but... <laughs> no, no, no. Don't say no. Okay. There's this nice one I want you to try. 
you will like it. Okay. So just calm down, relax. I'll fix you something. All right. <laughs> So, we're here. Yeah. Uh, thank you. I owe you a lot, actually. You don't owe me anything there. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I owe God gratitude for your healing. Well, true. Um, but thank you all the same. Um, so, I guess I'll see you around. Sure. Okay. Bye. Bye. Just gonna get my bag. <laughs> Vera? Yeah? Can I come in? Um Wow, uh the thing is I have been away for quite a while and that that place is going to be like super, super messed up and I would have to do spring cleaning for it. Could I invite you specially some other time, please? Well, I don't mind how messed up or untidy your house is, but if you insist, it's fine. Thank you. Some other time then. Okay. Bye. Bye. Vera? It's nice knowing you. Same here. Take care. Okay. Love a boy. I see you've got yourself a new toy. Steph! I didn't expect to see you around. What brings you here? I came to see a friend in the neighborhood. So, who was that? Uh, oh, a friend. A friend? I see you've gotten over me already. What I feel for was you. in the past. It was nice to see you again. You don't know what you're getting yourself into. If I can't have you, no one will.
pay for it. Can you just imagine? Hmm. Uh, and the guy thinks he can get away with anything. I'm telling you. Uh, you see, I want the boy. I want <laughs> this guy, but he wouldn't listen. <laughs> it is in every between he's nine good the truck. <laughs> <laughs> you know, chop is on his own and cut up for neck. <laughs> <coughs> Let's see how it wriggles out of this mm. one. <laughs> Try. Useless boy. <laughs> uh huh. Greg. Vera and I have decided to give each other a chance and see if things would work out. That's my man. <laughs> That's my real man. That's a, uh... <laughs> so, have you proposed to her? Oh boy, now for you? Which guy I talk with that one? I saw they propose for your village. No. Um, anyway, I do have positive feelings about her. Okay. And um, we've decided to take things one step at a time. You know? Mm. Moreover, she's not in a rush. Mm. Oh, shit. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Have fun. Yeah. Take all the time you need. <laughs> You. I called your family and no one seems to know your whereabouts. I mean, I, I, I've been to your house a couple of times. I met your absence. I called your, your, your friend, your best friend, Vera. She's been dead, boy. And myself, yes, I've had I people thinking about you. Where have you been, girl? L listen, I know you're upset with me, but what could I have done? Well, you didn't even give me a chance to explain myself. Okay, the girl, I mean, the girl you saw, she, she's my cousin, remember? I mean, she's my, 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 my father's younger brother's daughter. Oh, shit, then come on, right. Maybe, you know what? I, I'm so sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, babe. <laughs> Steve, what did you just say? Hmm? Did you just hear the words that came out of your mouth right now? Your, 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 your father's brother's sister's cousin. Oh, oh, what did you say? You're such a pathological liar. Listen to me. Eh? I don't care if she's your, um, your father's great-grandmother's ancestor. I don't care. Just make sure that those stinking fingers of yours never touch me again. Babe, I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, okay? okay? You know what, yeah? I'm going to make it up to you, okay? I'll take you shopping to the cinemas, and after which you go to my family. <laughs> what, what? You never cease to amaze me, Stephen. <laughs> what? Shopping, cinema, and, and, and you, you taking me to your family. Well, that's, that's supposed to magically make everything all right. Uh, yeah, that might have made a difference, I don't know, four or five months ago. But right now, I'm so not sorry to disappoint you. I am so over you. Babe, will you stop being difficult? Okay, I, I, yes, I messed up a little bit. A bit? Oh, okay, a lot. Yes, a lot. Baby, come on, please. Baby, please. Uh, please, please. Don't do this to me, please. Okay, you need to cut out this drama because you're embarrassing me, okay? And it's irritating me right now. Baby, I don't care who's watching or who's not watching. All I care about is you. Baby. Vera, please. You, you're like the air I breathe. Please, baby, don't oh, do this to me, please. please. Okay, you know, we just stop there. I'm seeing someone. Okay, so just stop right there. What? Who? No, no, that's a joke, right? That's a joke, because we're meant to be together forever, that's... remember? <laughs> you know, that's your problem, Stephen. That has always been your problem. You've always taken me for a joke. Always. You think I wasn't suspecting you for a while, but I stayed because, you know what, I, wo I, I was hoping that one day you'll wake up and realize that you actually have something good. But no. <laughs> uh, you know that saying, um, treat me like a joke, I'd leave you like it's funny? Yeah, well, that's what's happening right now. This is real, bro, that, okay? That. Look. I'm late for an appointment, okay? And you're in my way, so please move. Vera, Vera come on, Vera, Vera. Excuse me. Vera! Vera!
cleaning up this rubbish. Look what we got here. Alvin! Hi. Who are you? Steven Williams, what friends and lovers call me Steve. What do you want and why are you blocking my entrance? Hey, 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 calm down, okay? One question after the other. And just so you know that I come here in peace, except of course that you want this to be something else. Take this trash out of my entrance. Not after I state my mission here, Mr. Alvin. You see, I hear that you drop my girl off every now and then. That's very kind of you. As a matter of fact, on behalf of myself and my girlfriend, we want to extend our heartfelt appreciation to you. But hey, stay clear of her. We're getting married soon. Who is this woman of yours, if I may ask? You're smart. You know what the fuck I'm talking about, right? Anyway, the only woman I know is Vera. Actually, my woman now. And she told me about um, a cheating, good-for-nothing, low-life boyfriend of hers. Actually, ex-boyfriend of hers. Who used and dumped her. Oh, so you're that useless, good-for-nothing boyfriend. Thank God she's free from your shackles. Then you know so well about me that you need to know. That's very good. I didn't think you were that smart. Hey, quite impressive. Boy, a piece of advice though. There are lots of cheap, low-life girls on the street. Take a peek. And just so you know that um, my next visit here won't be this peaceful. You know what I'm talking about, right? And hey, You've done work for yourself. Yeah, you should work hard and get something like this for yourself. See you in a bit. How are you, darling? Good morning. Good morning. Aha! Uh -huh. Please come. Are you still leaving for school this morning? Yes, as soon as I'm done with the cleaning, I'll begin to school. Okay, I left you some money in your room. Okay. So once you're done, you can take it and leave. Alright? All right? Thank you. Take care of yourself. All right. Yeah. Bye. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah, hello. Good afternoon. Yeah, Susan speaking. Police from Area A. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I know her, sir. She's my friend, sir. Sir? Okay. Okay, sir. Um, I hope she's all right. Okay, sir. I'll be on my way, sir. Okay. The number you are trying to call does not exist. Alvin, um, a policeman just called me now. I don't know. He 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 he, he said I should meet him at Vera's place. I don't know. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, okay. Mr. Alvin. Alvin. Mr. Alvin, what was your relationship with the deceased? She was 
my girlfriend. Hmm? My friend, though. My very good friend. Hey, <laughs> Vera. Your friend was murdered. It's very obvious with a deep stab on her chest. Who could have done this? What crime did this innocent girl commit to deserve such act? I've already made arrangements for the ambulance to come and take her cops to the mortuary. Then we find a way to reach our relatives. Oh my God. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Please. Do all you can to apprehend whoever is responsible for this nefarious act. We will try our best. But please, do not hesitate to give us a call anytime you feel you have any relevant information. Please don't touch her. your life on hold because of someone who is dead and gone. Please, you need to put yourself together. You need to move on. He won't understand. She will... Vera was lovable. She was sweet. She, she was charming. She was enchanting, she was everything beautiful. But now she's gone. Brother. She's gone. Brother, I know. It's a pity. It's a pity she's gone. Hey, it's a pity. But you need to move on. Yeah, I know her dad purely speaks of kindness, but you need to move on, please, brother. Okay. You need to. You really need to move on. <laughs> I understand how you feel. Trust me, I really, really understand. I understand.
evening, bro. Good evening. Where are you coming from? I think I told you I was going to school to submit my school fees receipt. Of course, I'm coming back from school. You're welcome, darling. Thank you. I hope they're sweet because I'm hungry. I'm going to start. Yes, there is. Okay. I'm so tired. Yeah.
Grace. Grace. Brother, you called. Sit. What is going on? What's going on? Do you know anyone by the name Steve? Steve? Make you bleed to death if you play smart with me. I repeat myself, hoping not to say this again. Do you know anyone by the name Steve? Yes, yes, yes. Where were you a day before Vera was murdered? I, 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 can't, I can't remember. Oh, okay, 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 yes, yes, yes. I remember, I remember. Start talking. Um, I was with Steve. Why did you kill Vera? I did not kill her. I didn't kill her. I swear in my life, I didn't kill her. I saw this at the crime scene. You mind telling me what your bango was doing in Vera's house? So, how have you been? I hope you're getting better now. Yes, I, I'm, I'm better now. Thank you. Okay. Wow. I love your sandal. Uh, thank you very much. I, I like your bracelet. It's, it's very nice. Really? It's very, very pretty. Okay, you can have it. What? Uh, really? You can have it. Uh, like uh, you're giving it to me. Mm -hmm. I gave her the bang 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 the day she came here. <laughs> Met her before? I, I didn't want you to, to, to know. Yeah, I was the lady she saw at Steve's house. And that was the reason why I decided to travel. I, I thought she recognized me after she's fully recovered. And then because of that, she went to Steve's house and you both plotted her death? No, no! Come in. <laughs> 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 
，我不要 S P， 我不要，我不要 S P， 对不起，对不起，你说不要 S P， please please， 我不要 S P B， baby please， 我不要 S P， 啊，哥，啊。Hello. Hello, Alvin. Hi. Susan, are you okay? Yes, I'm. I'm fine. Um, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Um, Alvin, please, can you can you come to my house now, like now? Um, Susan, I don't think right. I don't think right now is a good time because um, I'm kind of indisposed. I I, I don't think I can come to your place right now. Alvin, you need to come to my house now. Um. It has to do with the death of, of, of Vera. What? How would you mean anything? Susan, why are you like this? Where are the policemen? They are on their way. Okay. Um, I was going to ask you, how how did they catch up with the killer? I killed Vera. Cute fair. You say the accident happened here. How come her body was in her room? I mean, how come they found Vera's body in her own house? I took her there. What? Jesus, Vera, Vera, 
Vera, Vera, Vera, see. Oh, okay, Vera. What's going on here? Good day, Mr. Arvin. Good day, madam. Madam, you said you have an information about the killer of Miss Vera? Yes. Um, 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 I killed her. Officer, I'm, I'm the killer you've been looking for. <laughs> Officer, she has told me everything, and I just want it to be on record that it was an accident. Miss Susan, you have to follow us to the station then. <laughs> Mr. Arvin, do you know this young lady? No. No, um... Yes, officer. She's my kid's sister. She's a murderer. She was caught sneaking out of one Mr. Steve's house. And if not for the intervention of my men, she could have been murdered by the man's neighbor. Officer, my sister is innocent. That would be for the judge to decide. I killed him. What? I thought, I thought he was res I thought he was responsible for the death of Vera. It wasn't my intention to kill him. I he became violent when I went to his house and then, and then I killed him. So please release my sister and and take me of the one you're looking for. In that case. You all will follow us to the station. Officer. Stop. Arrest them. Okay. Ah, move it. Shh. Hey, move it. Hello? Shh. Move it. I said move it. Move it. Oh yeah, move it. 